Hi, this is Rick DeWitt with Axiom, and this is translation secret number five. And we're going to call this the remapping secret, all right? And remapping means taking things like levels or colors, weights, line types, and fonts, and turning them into something different when you're going from, say, AutoCAD to MicroStation or MicroStation and AutoCAD. And the reason for this is that AutoCAD shops and MicroStation shops usually create things a little differently. For example, line types in MicroStation and AutoCAD are different, so you might want to change a line type used in MicroStation to something different in AutoCAD or vice versa. And you control these through the save as dialog box in microstation so we're going to go to file save as and we're going to take save as type and we're going to click that button and we're going to choose the type we want to save I had an AutoCAD file open so we're going to save it to microstation v v8 DGN format when we do that the options button if you click it will open a dialog called save as v8 options and on there you have several tabs and the first one is remap and this is where you can control remapping of these five categories of items levels fonts line styles colors and weights we do it or the microstation translator does it with a CSV file but since CSV files are a little hard to read you can create an Excel template that helps you define these things and save them into the CSV format. So by clicking the create icon here we can give our new spreadsheet or template a name and we'll call ours A to M test 1 and this is AutoCAD to MicroStation test 1. It'll give it a CSV extension and then it'll open it up in a template with an XLS extension and for each of the five categories we have a tab for levels one for colors weights line styles and fonts and each one of these categories you can map for example the AutoCAD in this case line type to a V8 output line style a standard numbered line style or a custom line style and there are a number of different columns in each one of these worksheets there's column descriptions that tell you what data should go in each column hope that helps you in your translation <music>